Okay, so now I got my password. It starts with a number, so I'm clicking the number. And now instead of my thumb, I'm using a um, stylus that has a rubber or a special point that you can use this for typing. So I need to go to the alphabet. It's uppercase. And I really... On uh, note, now I'm holding down the, this is all uppercase, so I'm holding down the uh, shift. That's it. Join the network. Okay, it should be going. There we go. Next. And it says it may take a few minutes to activate the iPad. So, uh, location services allows maps and other apps to gather and use data indicating your appro approximate location. You can leave it or not. Uh, I don't like necessarily everybody to go. Later I'll check. You can always change this. Right now I'm disabling that. I'm going to next. Disable, well, now it's not going to be able to maps, but you can go back and turn, it's telling me that I can go back and turn it on at another time. Right now, if I wanted it to maps, that's fine. Uh, now you choose whether you want to set it up as a new pad or restore, and I'm setting it up as a new iPad. It's already checked by default. Next. Now my Apple ID is used to set up iCloud, the App Store, iTunes stores, and more in the iPad. Uh, I want to sign in with an Apple ID that I already have so that everything I have will already be accessible on this. So I need to break and get my Apple ID.